They're all in line. They're off. And it's Tar and Feather who came out well. Right alongside is Double Bolt. These two out the best. And they're followed by Diamond Earring pursuing fate on the inside and racing right behind them. Two and a half lengths more back to Gentle Humor, who's racing down on the inside of Yasta, while Ring Knocker trails the field. So they go up the back stretch, and two of them are going at it up front. Double Bolt, Tar and Feather. And a 22 and two first quarter. Double Bolt's got a half length in front. Tar and Feather on the inside, second by two and a half, pursuing fate is third. Racing gets going from fourth, four and a half lengths to make up. Then it's Diamond Earring, separation of four more lengths. Back to Gentle Humor. And then it's Ring Knocker and Yasta. And it is Double Bolt who opens up to lead by two and a half and pursuing fate takes second, a 45 and two half mile. They're into the stretch. Double Bolt trying to keep on going here. And Tyler Gaffleone shaking up Double Bolt for another furlong. Pursuing Fate is coming on. And so too racing. And then Diamond Earring to the outside and Ring Knocker. Pursuing Fate getting to Double Bolt late. Pursuing Fate's got it. Pursuing Fate to beat Double Bolt. And then it was Diamond Earring followed by Ring Knocker and racing. Four oh seven ten. Dime super forty dollars seventy one cents. Super high five six hundred thirty seven dollars. The double twenty nine twenty. And the pick three seventy forty. In the eleventh race, there's exacta trifecta, superfecta, and super high five wagering. Scratch three red.